Hello everyone, welcome back to the Crafting Nook. I'm Enoch, this is Felicia. She's going to show you everything you need to know about crafting. Hello, hello, hello to my crafty creators. How are y'all doing? I am doing fine. I am Felicia with the Crafting Nook and today I will be doing these stones. They're supposed to be like healing stones. I haven't looked up you know exactly what each one of them mean so forgive me if i haven't uh told you exactly what's what okay i just thought it was a pretty mold and maybe by the time that i finish with this uh video i will be able to tell you um what each one of them mean um now i do know that um some of them represent you know they have different colors and all of that but of course, I'm not gonna follow the directions on the different colors. However, I will be using um, Lores transparent tints. And I will also be using, um, I think I will be using these little angels here that I've got from the first donation of last week. Hoping that you would uh, be able to uh, I don't know when this video will be released because I'm, I've been making a lot of videos. So today is Tuesday the 29th. Um, I haven't been feeling very well, but I still try to continue to make the videos for you all. So I have my resin mixed already. I have eight ounces in here. I'm going to put uh, an ounce in each one of these little measuring graduated measuring cups um and i'm gonna go from there that's a little more oh my gosh i'm messy too y'all so let's just uh not use that against me <laughs> oh boy I don't I'm I'm so I don't know what it's gonna look like I think it's gonna be cute but at the same time I don't know because I haven't done these before and I think the way that these are done like once they're poured and cured I think you are to take them and put them like use some UV or something and put them like that so that it would have the back and the front okay so let's just take this off for the moment and we're gonna continue so I'll, I'll check to make sure everything is still in frame since I'm moving things and all of that kind of stuff I have just a little bit left So, I'll take you through these colors that I have for the tints. And let me make sure you're in focus and camera. Okay, that's nice. So, I'm going to start off with the um, Plum Purple by Lores. It's the transparent ink, okay? Plum Purple is what we're going with. I'll start off with only one drop and see am I gonna need more so okay y'all I, I thought I recorded um I don't know what happened to my video it stopped when I was putting like I used one drop in every ounce that I had okay and this is my leftover resin um this got caught up in the cranberry and stuff and, and I got him out, was laughing and carrying on and I was like, yeah, yeah, my viewers gonna be happy of that. But y'all, it's not even recorded. So anyway, the next step that I've gotta go to, which is the um, 
when I take the stones out, I'll use UV to attach them to, together. And that'll be the end of that. But I'm so sorry that you all didn't get a chance to um, see how this is done. But I only used one ounce per thing. I think you may have saw that. And I used one drop of tint in each one of them, except this last one, which is the deep ocean blue. This last one, I used two drops in that one. But anyway, um, I'll be back to show you the finishing results. Um, you can see, I hopefully, I ho hopefully I have the bubbles so that they're not, you know, they won't be in it because I just don't want the bubbles there. But y'all, it wasn't even recording. So I'm mad. It wasn't recording. It's not a bubble I see. Oh, what is that I see? You see it? You see it? Guess what I'm getting ready to do? Let me see. Is it still there? Got to see. Got to hold it a certain way. It's gone. <laughs> so I'll be back, y'all. Okay, my crafty creators. So again, I am so sorry that we didn't get like the whole entirety of the video. But um, I do want to go ahead and demold these. They look nice. I got to check them out to make sure that they don't have like a lot of bubbles or anything. So, oh, wow. It doesn't. I'm just going to sit that right there. <laughs> oh, wow. They're so nice. Look, y'all. Oh, no. I, I got to put some. Um, what do you all think? I got to put some ink in here and see we're we're supposed to um, link them together. Now, I do see that there will be a somewhat of a gap. Let's see. I'm going to stand up for you. Ouch. But I do see that it will be a gap. Never mind the ashiness, y'all. <laughs> it's early in the morning. Early in the morning. But look. The, it is nice, okay? You see that little small gap there? I'm trying to get it. Right there. The small gap. And I'm unsure whether the UV would actually put it together or not. But it's a decent sized stone, alright? Decent sized stone. Look, two fingers. I know it's ugly right now. Oh. I should have polished my nails. <laughs> um, but it is gorgeous. It really is. I like it. Now, we do want to put some type of paint up here on it so that it will stand out. Um, oh, I like to drop it. But that's nice. So let me go ahead to the next one. I'm spending too much time on one thing, huh? I know, I know, I know. This is equally nice. See how nice that is? I'm trying to, yeah, right there. Yeah, I'm, I'm just trying to look around in here. I don't see anything visible. That is some awesomeness right there. I know it's not a word probably, but it is awesomeness. Wow. Those tents that I got from Miss Laura's Art Corner? Okay. If they ain't the truth. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love these tents. I want every color, y'all. Is that bad? I want every color. Oh my. Let, let me see. Can I move this so that you can see from the white background? Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? It's so... It's so beautiful. <laughs> This one almost fit flat. I I wonder like when I um use my UV, which I'm I'm gonna use my UV, okay. But it's so nice, y'all. Look look how how it how 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 high it is. So it's almost an inch high, okay. Almost from the top of the dome to the bottom of the flat surface. Y'all, these tents, 
I I can't get over it. I it's I'm in I'm shocked. Like I'm really shocked. Look at this. There's a little teeny pinhole there. Very little. It's fine by me. It could go for a scratch or something, but it's it's so little you can't even tell it's there. Y'all, can y'all believe this? Can y'all believe this? Now this one fits snug, very perfect. Look at there. It almost don't want to come apart. Look, oh. <laughs> It's it stuck itself. Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> and they are dry. Oh my. Oh my gracious. Y'all it stuck itself. And I wanted to kind of line them up. You know, so that I gotta there it is. I wanted to line them up so that it would match identical to the back to the front. I want them lined up just right. I did it again. I better wait. <laughs> I better wait. Oh my goodness. Look at this one. Y'all, I know I'm taking too much time. Oh, just fast forward. Just fast forward. Look at it, y'all. This is beautiful. Oh. <sighs> like you know I wouldn't have had no idea I, I've always wanted to try the tents because I see you know so many people using the tents and stuff like that but I really you know just could not afford them at the time and I still can't but you know I could save for them but they are nice they are it's gorgeous y'all I'm I'm so amazed and I think that's why I'm like taking my time looking at these things. Oh, it's so nice. I have a um I have a subscriber. Um their name is Spiritual Compass and I think Spiritual Compass could help me um figure out how you know what these stones mean because I don't know okay I really don't know and I didn't have I had time to look them up but I forgot every time I, I forgot to look them up because I was so um, busy with doing other things trying to get myself healed up so Oh gosh, y'all. These are so nice. I want to make like so many of them because they came out so perfect. Here's a such thing. <laughs> so nice. Oh man. I don't know what these things mean. That's so bad. Oh. Y'all think I should do some of them in gold and some of them in silver or some of them all gold? I don't know. These are, they're stunning. I I love them. Okay, I know. I went on a long time with that. A long, long time with that. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, so I gotta make sure you'll be able to see. Oh. So I'll be working in this area right here. Let's see how many of these will be able to fit underneath here. Probably about, I'll probably do three or four at the time. I'm going to take my base off, okay? I don't need my base. This is my UV lamp. Um, I do, I did get it from Amazon. Um, hopefully I won't forget to link it along with all my tents. All my tents, y'all. Those things are gorgeous. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know whether I want to even take the paint and put on them. I really don't. They'd be so nice. Maybe I'll do one, but for right now, let's see which one I'll do. Um, any, any, mighty mo. <laughs> I gotta stop it. Oh my. Um, since there are two blues, like 
they're different shade blues but since there are two i'll get one of these and i'll get one of these because this is a closer shade too so um uh, i don't know <laughs> i'll do i'll do um one gold and, and one silver i guess i don't know i have to see I'll, I'll see i'll see but for starters let me get my gloves on i hope I, and every time i'm in the middle of a video and it's on to the next day or whatever y'all i always be like i hope y'all doing all right and i'm like oh gosh this video was um done a couple of days ago and so forth and so on and i'm like i probably already asked them <laughs> because i get to do um several things you know especially if it's something small i do several things and i do the video on them and i try to just like let them sit in my phone until i get ready to edit and if i'm lazy or not you know that's that's what happens okay so it was this one the one that fit really snug let me see i'll, I'll go through them so i gotta have my gloves on i'm trying to match it up oh gosh i can't tell <laughs> oh my oh i could turn it around from the back and tell okay so that is so neat um when you're using uv i think uh the uv is already linked in my um in the description i do have to get some more i think i'm gonna try another kind when i finish with this one um but this one has um serves it served its purpose but you want to wear your gloves you want to wear your um eye protective wear and that's because um, when you're using it, it, it can burn your eyes, okay? It really can. So if I were you, i try to, you know, have, wear something to protect my eyes. Of course, you all know I wear glasses. And, you know, when I first started using it, I would put those glasses on top of my glasses or either um, I would have to keep taking them off and putting them on because I couldn't see what I was doing. I think this is lined up just right kind of sort of so let's go with this first one let's go with this first one and uh i oh i see a little something <laughs> so i'm not gonna squeeze a lot maybe just a little bit more I want to be able to like rub my finger, take it and rub it around. I'm going to try to do this so that all of it gets a chance to um, be done. I think I might make a mess. I'm concentrating, y'all. <laughs> Get my paper towel. Okay. Should have had that ready anyway. So, when you do this, just make sure you have your paper towel ready. Because you want to um, wipe around so that you don't get uh, UV everywhere. All right? So I'm gonna try to get this back centered the correct way. Let's see. Wipe this hand off for a second. Uh, I think that'll do it right there. It looks It looks like it. Looks like it can make it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna go ahead and start this timer. I'm gonna put it on 30. I don't wanna just 
I can I can just sit it there. Hopefully it'll stay where it's supposed to be. Okay. <laughs> this is great. This is great. I'm so tickled. I'm so tickled. Oh my gracious. I am. I want to make sure you don't have anything in between that could possibly um, mess up your design looking from the outside. Okay. That was fast. It was only 30 seconds though. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I see where I didn't have it so great right here. So make sure, because it, it'll look like a crack. I'll show you in just a minute. So this time I'm going to try my best to get it all the way around. Let me see how good of a suction does this have. Um, not so great. This one is not so great of a suction. I have a little lip there, so I don't know how that'll work. But again, doing my little, I think I've, I've done about two good drops up here. All right. I try to hold it here and take it with one of my fingers to try to spread it around. And as I'm spreading it, I'm just pulling it to the edge, okay? Pulling it to the edge so that maybe um, it will be evenly um, done. All right. I'm trying, y'all. <laughs> okay, I've got to wipe my finger off. And then I need to find my, um, find out where it is that I can put this so that it will line up from the front and the back. This is so tricky. I'm not lined up at all. Cut it upside down. I can go there. There's nothing on my hands. Uh, I wish that it could like really get a great suction. All right, I'm gonna leave it let it go for 30 seconds. Guess I can put that one back in there too. It's not going to hurt for you to leave it in there extra couple of seconds anyway. Oh, <laughs> oh my. This is so awesome. Like I'm so surprised at this turnout. I really am. Okay, so, ooh, this one is giving me a time. <laughs> okay, I think that, that that's it right there. At least I'm going to try. How about that? <laughs> so, those were my two little, um, and I, I just so happened to get a bubble in there, but, you know, you see how it kind of just disappeared. I'm spreading. Okay. Right, almost there. Okay. So that should work. I get this off my fingertip. I don't want it to get anywhere else and I'm checking the back which is the top checking it trying to make sure there's nothing there I hope this seal is nice it appeared to be oh no I see a little bit seeping through on the sides 
Oh no. Oh no. I think I put too much up there that time. That's why the suction had, uh, was so well, I guess. This one is gonna be messy, y'all. I better, and it, it keeps sliding too. I don't know. I better use the flashlight for a moment to help me out. Like I, it's sliding. I hope I'm in the same spot. I don't know if I am or not. I'm just gonna have to do it. Just so that I can get it to uh, seal a little bit. So it'll stay in place. Gotta wipe my hand off. Oh my. Okay. It it helped me, okay. But this one is almost a mess. Let me stand up and let you see how it is. A little upset about that but carry on <laughs> carry on honey 30 seconds carry on and it's probably about time for me to take that uh the pink and the blue one out all right so i'm gonna continue to do this i did want you to see how it it is to work but just now it let me see that it, it can be aggravating a little bit so I don't want to hold you all on that because I mean we all go through aggravation and you you saw for yourself <clears throat> excuse me how it can be but I don't want to just strictly hold you on that so when I come back I'll be showing you all the pieces together and then maybe we can do the um the painting on two of them all right so I'll be back okay y'all I am back and I have the stones put together I don't like them put together but you know I'm I'm just gonna have to deal with it if um to me okay this is only to me I wouldn't even bother about putting the bottom stone on I mean, because you still have a flat surface, you still have the dome surface. The only thing is your bottom surface won't be rounded as this, but you can always take a file and go around the edges so that they won't be sharp, okay? So what I'm gonna do now, I'm not even gonna um, paint all of them or anything like that because I'm, <laughs> I went from a natural nice high with this thing to like I hit rock bottom <laughs> but uh another thing I want you to uh notice is on <coughs> excuse me you don't really need a lot of UV but if you can see in there um you can tell that the UV is in there a little bit I don't like that part um not to say anybody is going to be just like, you know, if you got a healing stone, I'm sure you're not going to just constantly look at it and, you know, dream about it and all this kind of stuff. So, um, I just wanted to bring that to your attention as well. And, uh, as I was doing them to me, the best way to do it is take your, um, your bottom piece, sit your bottom piece like this right here, just sit it down on the table have your other piece in your hand put your UV on take your glue I mean a um, popsicle stick and spread it around and then pop it on use your UV light to like keep it in place for a second or two and then if you want to transfer it to your bigger lamp 
that was the easy the easiest that I found for me. Now um, I'm gonna do this uh, paint really quick, and we're gonna wrap this video up, my friend. I was about to say I thought I used this purple before, which I did. You see it right there. <laughs> I just, for some reason, I don't use the squeeze part on the bottle. I never do. L look at that. That's how long I probably took to uh, use this. Oh gosh, now I believe it's stuck. It's not even six months old. But I guess when you don't go over there and shake them up and mess with them and use them and stuff like that, it will do that. But the paint in there is still good, you see. See? So I'm going to take my smallest end on my dotting tool. And I'm going to attempt to uh, just let it go around in here. Um... I'm so disappointed a little bit. Like, I really thought it was going to be something else. I don't know. I still like the stones. They're still cute. You know what? Instead of doing this, I should have just took a paintbrush and painted it and, and just wiped it off. Dear God, my child dear god <laughs> I tell you sometimes I can make things appear to be so hard when they don't really have to be I'm just spreading this around up here by the way this is the um, amethyst metallic am amethyst I like these colors bought them a while ago to do something I, I have no idea what it was I was doing or what I was going to create or whatever sometimes I just get paints for when I do get in that moment I will make sure that I have them so now that it's all in place there I'm just going to go ahead and wipe that off <laughs> it's like I just really don't I, I really don't care about this right now <laughs> isn't that something oh my and I'm just going to wipe it off okay just going to wipe off and there's my metallic um, paint hold it up a little closer now, of course, I need to make sure everything is really clean with it. But I'm so discouraged. <laughs> like, uh, <laughs> there's something else. Let me wipe my little tool off. Because I'm not going to need that. Okay, this other one is metallic ice blue. All right shake it up really good and I'm gonna do the same exact thing let's get this little piece of mess out of here the yucky stuff all right so I'm gonna take this metallic ice blue go along there and just go around and they're making sure that the um, it gets in the grooves really good okay some people let it kind of dry I don't I've been too afraid to let it dry I don't know why but I have wipe this back off and Get another paper towel. I go through some paper towels. Ooh, honey, I've got to get me a, a, a lot more paper towels. Because I go through them. 
getting paint all over the place. All right. But you see how everything stays in that groove. It's nice. It cleans up very well. So you don't have to worry about that. Okay. So let me let you see this one. Ice blue. It looks ice blue to me, but looking in the camera, it doesn't look ice blue. I don't know. When I do the playback, then I'll be able to see. So do y'all want to do a, um, a rose gold or a uh, antique copper? I, I haven't used the antique copper. Let's do this one, okay? <laughs> I just decided real quick for y'all, right? I know. I have not used this one before. It is cute. Cute. I like it. Pop that bubble. Guess I'll put it on this one. Now, I got some paint. <laughs> I was just in the bubble. So, uh, Mike, I don't really have a conclusion on this. All I'm going to say about it is that, uh, make sure you have some nice UV. You be able to take your time with it. Um, you make sure that you know it's everything is lined up I don't think that you need the bottom piece I really don't unless you just want it you know to complete it I don't think the bottom piece is necessary I don't I don't I don't so I'm gonna just wipe this off that antique copper looks nice up there Isn't that what I said this was? So, I hope I stayed in, in uh, frame. <laughs> oh my. Oh my. Maybe I did. Bring that up so you can see that one. Oh, low battery. Take this so that I can match this button. Okay. So since I have a low battery, okay, I have to turn it like this so you'll be able to see it. It's still nice, okay. Don't get me wrong. It's it's still nice. All right. Uh, let's go with a uh put this over here so I can link it mm, you want to go with the let's see that's just regular gl uh, gloss sterling silver let's put the sterling silver on the red well the cranberry that's I've, I've got to get my um say the right things with this um with these tints Y'all gonna uh, continuously hear me correct myself on it, but um, I don't mean to say anything. I don't mean to call anything outside of its correct name, but you know, sometimes I just don't do it. So I got me a good bit up here. I don't think I'm gonna uh, do the bottoms. I don't think it's necessary. But the, the tops, I will continue to um, do them. I was just going to do, <clears throat> I think this is the last one I'll do. So that I can take a picture and be done with this. Um, they are neat stones. They really are. 
just felt some kind of way. <laughs> oh my. So we're cleaning up this sterling silver. I almost need a new paper towel. Okay. So I didn't get that as good as I needed to, but it's still nice. Okay. Still nice. I'll take a, a better picture, you know, close up. But um, thank you all for watching. And please like, share, comment if you would like to. I would love to hear your comments and your thoughts on these healing stones, okay? So y'all have a good evening, night, morning, or whenever you get this video. Um, today is Wednesday the 30th, so maybe, just maybe, I don't know when I'm going to get it out. <laughs> but I'll see you later, guys. Bye.